Hello everyone, Messy Players here, back at it again. How you doing today? I am playing Resident Evil 2. The tyrant is still bloody here and he's following me and I've managed to blow his hat off. Uh, I don't know if you saw it last time, unfortunately it cut off, but I was in the library. The tyrant ran after me. That music is freaky as hell. I was in the library, I think this is the way, and he actually he went the long way around above a ladder and then jumped on top of me and it was kind of funny this is this is the wrong way we're going the wrong way yeah i've got no way to get away from him so i'm gonna have to go this way god damn hopefully this is fine can i open this door yet He just doesn't stop chasing you, does he? Fuck off. The sound design is so incredible in this game. Half of the chilling experience is just the hissing of the zombies. Like, uh, Resident Evil, Capcom especially, obviously, have got a lot of experience in this genre, but they lost their way. And I think they've just managed to circle back around, recharge their batteries, and they've just made the kind of definitive zombie experience here. They don't feel, they don't feel tired. They don't feel, uh, you know, cliche or played out. This feels exactly right. The ladder's in the right position. I should be able to cross over now. Is the tyrant gonna? Is he following me? Does he always just follow you or does he look for you? I have a feeling he always just... Okay, this isn't a new area, but are the lights off now? Why is it so dark up here? And why can I hear rain? I gotta move because I think the tyrant could follow me. Okay, there is zombies here. Uh, I've got no fucking ammo. Oh, this is not wonderful. I love this game, to be honest. I really love this game. I didn't even see him there. Come on, he was behind the pillar. That they're cheating a bit there. I'm gonna have to go in here. I mean, I need ammo. Police station, clock tower, due to the high cultural value of the bell, I'm calling a specialist in to make repairs. We'll go over the details, blah blah blah, let's just, oh. Nothing really interesting, oh, we need to find a missing part, I'm guessing. There's so many items in this. Well, they haven't followed me in here. How do I get that down? Every single area of this game is just fucking creepy. I've got nothing I can put in there. I'm sure I just saw a foot. Nope, I'm fine, I'm good. I'm playing on normal, and I think I've been pretty cons conservative with the ammo. And I'm struggling. I'm just constantly struggling. I think this is the other side. Okay, what's this? More gunpowder. All right, what's this gonna make? Let's just do it. Oh, sweet. Okay, that's me sorted. I'm surprised. I'm surprised the Mr. Jump Scare there because this is a long corridor. And when you turn around, I'm surprised they didn't have someone standing there. Uh, Bioshock would have done that for sure. Fucking arse lickers or something coming after me. What's that sound? I've turned all the lights off again. I 
feel like it wants me to shoot that. Sorry. <coughs> I'm really sorry about that. Um, it's hard to turn the blue yeti off. Like, the little button just doesn't want to, you know, respond at times. So you got to click it a few times. It's easier just to sneeze sometimes. Can I shoot this off? I don't want to waste any ammo. Let's just try one bullet. No, nope, that's not going to do anything. Right. Is there now in here I can do? Okay. I'll just... Uh, let's look at that note one more time. Uh, I'm calling a specialist. Right, they've said they've taken steps to secure it. So I need to unsecure the bell, I guess. I, I mean, I don't know why. keep calling him the tyrant but I don't know if that's his actual name I've seen some people online call him Mr. X all right never mind Okay. I'm trying to do it with as little ammo as possible. I don't know if he can follow me up there, but uh, hopefully he can't. Um, let's just use this. Unfortunately, I would I would love not to. Okay, is this going to be an area I already know? Fuck's sake. They're doing this on purpose. Jesus. Where's Mr. X? Is that really his name? Is he walking towards me? Fuck's sake, man. Holy shit. Yeah, he is walking towards me. Fuck's sake. There's like nothing I can do. Fuck. Is he gonna jump down? Yep. Gonna jump down, any? Well, that pisses me off because I don't really get anything. This game is so bloody intense, but I didn't really benefit from that. Uh, what's this a key for? Right, how do I get back to the garage? It's the shutters. Fuck me, is he just walking everywhere? Honestly, at this point... Oh, this, this gets me to the garage, I think. If I die at this point, I die. No point fretting about it. I really want to shoot that thing, but then again, it's just a waste of ammo. Let's check the map. Okay. Now he might be up here. I don't know where he's going to come out. Just 
fuck's sake, I'm using all of my ammo. I really wish they didn't have two keys that were pink. That's bloody confusing. <gasps> There's a cog. I'm not gonna waste any, um... Oh my god, two parts. Oh, it automatically shifted something, that's awesome. Good quality of, uh... Quality, quality design there. I'm not gonna use any ammo on Mr. X. I think that's just a complete waste. But I think he hears gunshots. And there he is. He didn't get very far. He might kill the zombies for me, which would be awesome. I don't really want to hang around. This is where I went to. Yeah, he's coming. He doesn't jump down. Uh, he seems to just want to hang around. <sighs> I wish you could just like drop stuff from that menu. Oh, I needed that. Okay. Discarded that. Sorry, I'm... I am making progress, It's but it's a little slow. The unnerving thing is, he's just... I think he's right where I need to be. I'm trying to work out where that clock room thing was again. Um... T-bar handle slot. Um, I can't open this door. No, I can. How do I get the the thing to that save? I think the term blue. If I get everything I need from them. That's what I assume. This, the crazy thing is, I don't know where the sound's coming from. I just don't know where the sound's coming from. There he is. God damn. I'm fucking freaking out, man. It's not so bad, because if he catches you, you can get away. It's just fucking scary. It is scary as hell. Um, let's go this way. I somewhat judge, uh, I somewhat trust this library. They're usually dead in here. Yeah, they're getting better. These guys seem permanently dead now. I wonder if he can walk along here as well. I mean, how many people are like, just completely shitting themselves playing this? Uh, he's down there, he's gonna hear the gunshots, but I have to shoot this one. I think this is a fuck's sake. I mean, it's brilliant, but you know. Okay. I didn't think that would work. 
Can you just give me one second? Okay, sorry about that. It's infuriating not being able to pause. But it is what it is. Like, he's so close to me now. There's going to be somebody in here, isn't there? Oh, shit. Right, I took something off there. Can I turn my light off? How do I turn my light off? I think I need to turn my... Hold on, let me check the options. Okay, there isn't an option to turn light off. Which is interesting, because that would be like another fear factor if... You know, you're hiding in the corner and you don't want him to notice you, so you turn the light off, but then you're in complete darkness. Like, how scary is that? But it doesn't look like there's an option to do that. And, like, he's just got it on constantly when he's in the dark. Like, I think the dude can come in here and he's gonna see my light. I'm, like, trapped. I'm pretty sure... Okay, I'm not sure what to do. This game is just, it is terrifying. I'll be honest, I've got no idea what's happening. What's happening? I can't take it out, so it's in the right place. I don't understand. I really don't understand this. I don't understand this puzzle. Okay, this works as well. Okay. Right, I think I've solved it. Oh my god. Why? It's gonna knock that off. Okay, that's the part I need. Mate, couldn't you... Don't have to write a report on this. How are you so chill? Like, that was a ton of fucking noise. Could you not have just got a broom and knocked it off? Like, Mr. Rex is gonna get me. He's definitely gonna fucking... Okay. Okay. Gotta go to the, uh... This is a dead end, isn't it? God, I'm so fucking on edge. I don't think you can come in here because it's pretty much a dead end. But then again, yeah, he's definitely going to be able to come in here. <laughs> okay. This 
thing is, I'm in a dead end. I can't get past them. There's no secret door or anything. So, uh, I guess I'll just fucking die then. I don't think you can come in here. Those fucking sounds. Okay. Now I have no idea where he is. He's moving. Okay. Let's head downstairs. I'm so fucking tense. And it's a complete shit show down here because all the dogs and shit are running around. They're impossible to hit. You're still there at least. Like, I may as, I, I might have needed to keep that, but you know. Say a window, board it up. Get an item space. Like, a proper cranium shot should down them. I hadn't opened that before. Interesting. Okay. Okay. A suspicious man was found at the location listed above. When confronted by an officer, he tried to escape by acting confused, but was arrested. He had a note. It's Justin Hansen. He was the one that died. He had the key in his hand, didn't he? Six, two... Ooh. Is this the safe for the waiting room? That's good. Keep a hold of that. What's... Ooh, hold on. Yes. What? Nice. Oh! Cool. That's awesome. I bet that's something they're giving away now. Pre-order of the game. That would be a nice little giveaway. This game's got so many cool ideas. Right, this one's permanently locked in. Now, that's Mr. X. Yet again. You start to just... Wait. Is this all that's down here? Okay. Well, I definitely need that dongle. It's just weird. Leon doesn't say anything about Mr. X, like he doesn't, he hasn't asked any personal kind of questions. Okay, I've got to, um, I've got to like catch my breath here. I think that's the safe there. Let's try and open that safe. Hmm. 
Okay. Um, I love this game. This is a really, really good game. Right. Six to the left, two to the right. Left six, right two, left eleven. Huh? Oh, wait. There you go. What's on a silencer? Okay. What can I combine that with? I can't go with a shotty. Nice. Fuck yeah. This game just feels so rewarding. It's, it's unlike a game I've played in a while. Where you just feel like this is brilliant. Is that the quickest way? Okay. I think this is the quickest way. Gotta get to the star's office and then I'll go to the garage thing. The garage I'm not looking forward to because all the fucking dogs, man. Is, is Marvin still not the dead? Like, dead dead. Dead 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 dead. Okay, what's this? Diamond door. I've got the diamond key. I mean, to be honest, I'd rather the handgun am ammo right now than the shotgun ammo. Okay, I need a pen and paper for this. I like these ones. I know I'm kind of like gushing over this game a bit. But I just, I haven't had a, a gaming experience like this in a while. Like, are people who played the original having this kind of reaction as well? Where it... <sighs> okay, let's, uh, let's try this. This, this is the hardest part, is orientating it the right way. Okay. Okay, I need to draw it again, sorry. This might take a little time. You basically just need to trigger them in a sequence. So you're best off writing down what each one. Okay, that's... Need to make sure I'm writing the right ones. Do people do this from memory? Are they different each time? Like if you were to speed run this, would you actually need a, like a pen and paper? Or can you just memorize it? These are the questions. Okay, let's... Uh, let's go from... Let's go from one. Oh, they actually dock in the buttons that you haven't used. That's kind of helpful. I don't think they needed to do that, but uh, you know, it's appreciated. Okay, I've got the second button. I may go back and do that. Um, this is what I need. Okay. Now I had said before, I don't think we would have a dongle in those days, but never mind. I think that's a unique little, uh, uni unique, ooh, what's this? Fuck yeah, is this the Magnum? 
Okay. Awesome. To my best of stars, buds, how are you all doing in that drab old station hanging in there against all irons? Me, I just got back from a date with a hot chick. Bet you can guess what we got up to under the, her extra large umbrella. Europe is amazement. One month is no way enough to even scratch the surface. Maybe I'll extend my vacation for another six months. Don't even think coming to join me. Da da da. Oh, is this Chris? Jill, if Claire tries to contact you, please let her know I'm okay. Okay, that's Chris Redfield. Off Gallivant Gallivanting in Europe. So which game was he introducing? I thought he was in the first one. That's what I know because I'm just... I'm not really a big... You know. Hmm. Makes me think we might be able to use that again. Okay, I'm just... I'm just taking it slow. Uh, I think next... There's another... There's a dialogue that... Um, it's when it... When there's sunk left to do, it turns red. I might go to the main hall... Oh god. Well that that kiboshes that idea. Guess I'm not going that way. Uh at times he's just he comes off as like frustrating. <laughs> like there's a dude here and that's gonna give me a jump scare. He's slowly breaking in. Oh god. Can I, can I survive this? I'm not gonna survive this. Let's go this way. Fuck, I might be doing okay. Uh, that was horrifying. Um, and you know, that could have been worse. It wasn't great, but could have been worse. I'm definitely glad I didn't play this on hardcore to begin with because I just I think I would have really struggled with this okay I'm gonna try and use this to store a couple of things I think we'll probably use that should we hold on to that hmm we'll just hold on to that briefly I'm gonna go and unlock that as well because that might give me some health where is that? Where is that again? That's the lockers, that's where they are. I may try and make that. I mean, if I die, I die. He's gonna come through here right now, isn't he? could really do with some health. That sound is fucking horrifying. I don't think they can come in here. Okay, let's just put the button on. Okay, two or three. I'm going to unlock all, all of them first. Two or eight. Two or eight. And one or two. That sound, man. And one or two. Okay. The tyrant's gonna come in here. K 
Yeah, I think that's probably all the stuff I can pick up. Yep, I can hear him. Okay. Come on, open the door. Okay, straight ahead then to the left. Fuck. Eee, he can't even get through the doors. Now has he hurt them a bit? Fuck me. That's scary as fuck. Like he's still coming. So I'm thinking about saving again. I'm really sorry. I hate wasting time, but you know, I'm fucking dying here. Okay, now I need a plan of action. Actually, I know exactly where I'm going. Don't worry about it. I know where I'm going. There, you just opened that door. Let's just check the map. Apparently this has got some shit in I need. Where's the herb? Okay, it's over here. It would be nice to, uh... To put it together, but, uh... I don't have time. I need to use it right now. Okay, I think that'll be this room cleared now. There's a health kit in that bathroom. Why are the fucking hiding behind doors and shit, man? I need to get in the bathroom. There's gonna be sunk in the bathroom as well, isn't there? Fuck's sake. Where is it? I need to just use it? Fuck. This game is just... It's horrifying. Okay. Oh god, man! How did I miss? Sick. Now I'm just getting fucking angry. You're severely under fucking powered here. I'm gonna just die because the dogs are crazy. Yeah, I mean, the dogs are crazy. Where's the garage? Let's see if there's anything on here. Oh, that's the fucking kennel. Damn it. Uh. What's this? A diamond door, great. Better be some good in here. Another... Oh, God. Well, they're coming. Um, what's my best option? Probably this thing. Oh, that's awesome. Okay, I love this gun. Obviously, I've got no fucking ammo for it. Anything else in here? Right, we'll clear this room. 
Today I want to talk to you something really important to me. You know my popular Mr. Raccoon. Target practice. Okay. I already knew that. I was shooting them anyway. There is one I've missed, but... Alright. Uh, what's this? Okay, here we go. I need to get in the garage. There's them stupid dogs. Oh, God, man. Fuck, man. That's so fucking hard to hit. I need to... I'm gonna die here because I've got no fucking options. Oh man, no, fuck's sake, the aiming is so hard. I'm gonna use this, but it's not gonna do anything, is it? No. Nah. Nah, however, this shouldn't take more than fucking three shots. I mean, I'm gonna go through here to respite, but... Probably end up in a fucking worse place. Where's the map? Is it just me or is the difficulty fucking ramped up? There's no health anywhere. I need to I need to tackle that room. But I just kinda manage it right now. I the aiming is so so oh, hold on, can I can I turn up the um sensitivity? I don't know what that means. I hope it's good. No ammo. Nothing really. The tyrant's probably right up my fucking ass. What the? I'm not even killing them. Like, they kind of be fucking. Why are the bullet sponges? However, they should give us a chance at least. That's so hard to hit. And the bullet sponges? Right, that one's down. Look at it! I hit it in the head! That one's down. That's a bit too hard for me, I think. The dog shouldn't have been bullet sponges. Right, one of, the, one of these cars... Let's try this. Which one's 7439? Here we go. Great. Matilda. What? Okay. I guess, okay. Now, I don't know what I'm doing, to be honest. I don't have the key card. No, I need the key card off that dude. Is, is the box for that thing? That's the card reader. So maybe the thingy goes in there. I'm, I'm gonna fucking die here, because there's no fucking way I can take any more hits. I've been trying to play as defensively as possible, but I do think they've been getting some cheap shots in here. Can I kill them? I'm just gonna defensively kill them. Okay. I mean, that might be a good plan of attack, but... Uh, oh, buddy. I'm not liking my chances here. Son of a bitch. Uh. 
Why do I... Oh, I don't know what I'm doing. I gotta open this. Wow. Okay. They're actually making us open boxes. Kind of fun. Different. Okay. Oh, okay. Okay, it has to be like that then. This one's hard. This is a hard puzzle. Nice. I'm guessing the tyrant is going to be instantly fucking after me now. Stations swarm with monsters every here. Everyone, he even here, I can hear their cries, but it's not zombies I'm afraid of. Codename Tyrant. I knew it was a tyrant. Ultimate bio weapon developed by those bastards in the utmost secrecy. To think that the thing might be wandering around here. Chances are they've ordered it to wipe out the witnesses. Okay, so you were, you'll be happy to know you are spot on. We've got to use that instantly. I'm afraid. I'd love to kind of save some shit, but, uh, just honestly, I, I, I wouldn't have a chance in hell. Okay. Do you want to listen to this later, maybe? When we're not in a fucking bottle end? Okay. Um. Okay. Is. I'm, I'm not too sure, but is that Wesker? Is that Albert Wesker? I knew it. Okay, they've just invented more. You bastards. Oh my god. Give me a break. Yeah, please. Mm. Yep. You, you want to just keep running, mate? How are you meant to How are you meant to do this? How are you meant to do this? Come on, the tyrant's right fucking behind me. Right, let's get in the air. Let's use this cod. Fucking hell, man. Leon, say something. God's sake. You're a fucking... You're a zombie, practically. Alright, this is Ada. The tyrant looks awesome. It's not the end of him. Or oh, is it Claire? Who is this woman? This is getting old. Saving your ass, it's twice. How is it never after you? Look, this isn't a game. Nothing dies down here. I love this. Boss fight, maybe? Why did you give her the evidence? Maybe. After I hear it. The, the dialogue is just so good. Like, yeah. it's not overly written during the cutscenes. They're not trying to say cool shit. Resident Evil 5 and 6 were just so fucking lame, to be honest. 
Now, did they leave me any goodies? I thought I might have got something. We might want to open the shutter. Yeah, give me a sec. Okay, I think the video is going to end in 10 minutes, but I just want to say thank you for joining me. I hope you've enjoyed this video. I need to sort this out because it's bugging me. I can't move anything. Oh, I can move. There you go. Sorry, I'm a bit OCD like that. Why are the cars so big? They've got a they've got a case of Arkham Origins here. Look at how huge that car is compared to him. You tower over a car when you stand next to it, usually. You know, like three head heights. That one's all right. Is that the intel you needed? Unfortunately, no. Ben didn't come through. Need to turn it up, Dad. What exactly are you looking for? More info on the people responsible for this mess. What about you? Trying to save the world? I told Lieutenant Brenna I'd bring help. Good luck getting that. Oh, there's got to be some health in here. Oh, come on, it's an ambulance. You couldn't have put one green herb on it or something? Oh, no. Oh, yes, gun shop. What the hell is this? Roads out. Going through that gun shop looks like the only way. So this was the sinkhole that we're talking about. Let me guess, there's going to be some crazy guy. There's always a crazy guy. You're pretty good at that. What a mess. Okay. Awesome. This game makes you really appreciate when you get new weapons. Like, in upgrade them. You know when, like, you play MGS4 or something and you just get endless amount of weapons and they're just, none of them have any kind of... They, like, kind of lose meaning. What are you looking at? This game, every weapon you just... Oh, here we go. I said, don't move! I'm just passing through. I'm gonna ask you to lower that weapon. I tell you what. You're gonna turn around and go right back out the way you came in. Oh my god. That's harsh. No! Wait! Step aside. We need to terminate her before she turns. Was this in the original? Fucking daughter. That's pretty hardcore. Yeah. Just let them be. We'll just leave them. Ma? Sweetheart, I told you to stay put. It's bad. Mm -hmm. She might just have a cataract or something. Poor dude. Oh, wow. This is just a brilliant game. You're a cop. You're supposed to know something. How did this happen? Huh? The motion capture as well, like... The performances here are really, really good. The lighting. There's not much to complain about with this game. I think there's a little... Maybe not enough music in it, you know? Like, that's heartbreaking. I mean, that kind of coming off like so forced and cheesy. But the way that was just kind of... Just give us some privacy. What a like damn good cutscene. Like that could have been such a cheesy melodramatic scene and no. yet it just comes off as like it's brutally depressing. For me. But why him? They've killed, he's killed them both. 
I want to find out what's happening here and stop whoever's behind it. There's no way you would not. Helping people like them? That's why I joined the force. There's no way you'd want to live after doing something like that. My mission is to take down Umbrella's entire operation. We may not make it out. Whatever it takes to save this city. Count me in. So is this like the start of a beautiful friendship? I mean, I've played Resident Evil 4, but I don't know, you know, obviously there's a lot of characters. A lot of the models change. I've got a feeling he killed both of them. Ooh, that's eerie. Is that like a raven or like a crow? Heard of the Umbrella Corporation? That was just like a simple cutscene. Tightly written. Oh. Turns people into indestructible monsters. That explains the horrible things I've seen. Okay. And that's why I'm looking for Annette Burke. She's the one in Umbrella responsible for unleashing the virus. I'm going to bring her down. Well, I've got a picture to develop. Yeah, the video might end soon, but I just want to say thank you so much for joining me. If you like this video, please consider... Oh, we're not going in a sewer, are we? Please consider liking, commenting, and subscribing, and I'll catch you next time. Based on what you've said, the sewer seems fitting. Oh, God. After you. Gee, thanks. Gee. There's one thing worse than zombies, it's sewers. Can't imagine a real scientist being down here. Okay. Come on. Sewers are run by the city. How could they have a facility without the authorities knowing? Lots of money. Jesus. That earthquake? That's a fucking tyrant. What the hell is that? What the fuck? Was that a giant crocodile? I love this game's habit of showing you the um, the huge enemies just briefly. They've done that like three times already. But it's magnificent really. Okay. Probably not going to develop that. Probably don't need to use that. Okay. That's definitely not going to be used again. Okay. This is the right way? Unfortunately. Wait there. 